Esau Edom is suffering in his own kingdom. Shalom. First and foremost, giving all praises, honor, glory, respect, and blessings to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Rabakah Kadash. Salutations to the Lord's elect on the four corners of the earth, pushing this truth in all sincerity and patiently waiting for Yahweh Shai's return. Double honors to our apostles and elders of Great Millstone, which have taught us everything we know through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai. Evidence that masks protect from COVID not very strong in either direction, says UK's Deputy Chief Medical Officer. So, you know, if you look at the faces of these uh, people right here, they don't look too happy, okay? Now, 70, 80, 100 years ago, they would have all had happy faces. They would have all been smiling, you know, hands all up in the air, rejoicing, excited, having the time of their life. But now look, you know, everybody looks grim, somber, gloomy. You know, this also goes to show you how Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai is taking the spirit of mirth out of this whole world, man. The rejoicing city is no no longer rejoicing. You people are no longer rejoicing. You're no you can no longer have fun. Okay, your amusement parks are shut down. Your beach water parks are shut down. Your theme uh, uh, roller coaster parks are shut down. Disneyland shut down. Chuck E. Cheese shut down. These family feud uh, uh, places shut down. Laser tag shut down. Dave and Buster's shut down. So the, the spirit of fun and happiness and mirth, the spirit of being in that 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 dream is gone, man. It's gone. And you can tell just by looking at the the, the, the expressions on these people's faces, man. Okay. And as time passes on. Yahweh Bashum, Yahweh Shai is going to continue to take the mirth out of this world because we're living in a time of war. And we're also living in a time of the so of, of the downfall of the so-called white man's kingdom. So despite masks mandates imposed to stop the spread of COVID-19, which is all BS because really the masks are really being used to weaken your immune system. Because if you think about it, when you got the mask covering your mouth as well as your nose, you know, you're, you're, you're breathing in the same air that, that you breathed out. So because you're not getting clean air like how you should be, your immune system is breaking down. The United Kingdom Deputy Chief Medical Officer Jenny Harris cast doubt on their effectiveness, adding yet another wrinkle to the raging debate about face coverings. And also, I want to say this. In London, there has been mass protests and riots over the controversy of people wearing masks. So more and more people starting to become uh, uh, restless over the fact that they always got to wear a mask. Rather, if they're in like a group or large groups, etc. Okay. And Lord's will, I'm going to do a video on this next. But um, it says, as schools prepare to reopen, the government has released guidance that will that will require students and teachers to wear masks and communal areas. Masks are currently required in hospitals, on public transports, and in any businesses. And it's like that here in America, not just the UK, okay? In a Q&A 
session with Prime Minister Boris Johnson, however, Harry's pushback against the theory that masks help stop the spread of COVID-19, which really, it don't matter if you wear a mask, because if Yahweh Bashum, Yahweh Shai wants you to get COVID-19, you're going to get it, whether if you got a mask on or not. Adding further confusion to experts, changing attitudes in the area. Okay, did you hear that? Changing attitudes in the area. Asked by a parent about deaf children being able to properly learn, Johnson clarified that he does not want to see face coverings in classrooms. Well, guess what? Well, guess what? Face coverings is it, it, the new norm now here in America, whether you're in school or not. Okay, I mean, come on. People gotta wear face coverings when they go to work, but they don't have to wear face coverings when they go to school? Come on, man, this kingdom is finished. COVID-19 is an adult disease. Children at tiny risk of acute coronavirus. Okay, well, uh, I mean, that's pretty much all I'm, I'm, I'm gonna read there, man. So, uh, Shola Wong is on to the next one. Shola Wong.